Hey everyone, it's Desi Chang, and what do I have here? It is a nice package from Canon. So we're gonna go open it up uh, and see what's inside. Got my Leatherman. Oh. Ooh. 15 to 35 f2.8 is what is inside Ta-da! All right, guys. Right here, I have the Canon EOS R right now, mounted on with the brand new 15 to 35 lens, and right beside it is the 16 to 35 version two, marked onto the uh, Canon 5D Mark IV. So as you can tell. Um, in terms of the length, they're actually very, very similar. The one thing to note with the uh, Canon, uh, the RF one, is that when you do zoom out to 16, it does protrude a little bit. Um, so that's one big difference. And um, the other thing to note is that with the size of the lens hood, the, the new one is actually way smaller than the old one, uh, which is very, very helpful if you're gonna be putting it into uh, your pouch, your bag, things like that. The one thing I really hated about this one uh, was that you really, really just had to take it off every single time you wanted to put it into your bag and things like that, um, or into like whatever camera pouch. Um, but uh, yeah, so I'm gonna flip over now and shoot with the EOS R um, wide, and um, I'll tell you a little bit more. Actually, before that, um, I'll tell you what I feel, how it feels. So this is the, you know, version two. It feels, feels pretty good and well balanced because, uh, you know, obviously the 5D Mark IV has a bigger, thicker, beefier grip. Holding the EOS R with the uh, the new lens, it does feel um, front heavy. So, it, you know, I, I feel like I tend to kind of like, you know, go down, but uh, I do like the weight and I feel like if I had the battery grip on, it would feel a little bit better, but uh, yeah, so far so good. Uh, now let's see what it looks like on camera. All right, so this is just me uh, throwing the camera on with the 1635. Um, it does feel pretty heavy. I'm, I'm not holding a gorilla pod or anything like that, uh, but you can kind of see how wide it is. Um, and then, you know, when, if I move my face to the side like this, uh, my face does get distorted. So, in terms of the distortion control, um, you know, I wouldn't say it's uh, any better or any worse uh, than the other Canon lenses. Uh, it's about the same, but uh, yeah, this is what it looks like. But anyways, this is just an unboxing and a preview of the lens and the and, and what it looks like. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, stay tuned and I'll do more updates on this lens.